guys, the reviews to IGN, welcome to a new manager mode commentary with um, Boss Wanderers and welcome to a new episode after a long wait. Um, I've got a new desktop computer so I'll be recording my manager modes on there from now on. Um, so yeah, so um, we start this episode in about 12, as you, I think, I think, I can't remember, but I'm just showing you some... Um, stuff I'm going to be doing uh, put Hernandez in the CD on because Everton are quite a tough opponent actually as they've been on good form um, yeah so I'll get um, I'll probably get one out tonight as well management to so, um, so thank you guys for waiting and a like would be appreciated too because you know it's not all, it's not you who's just been waiting you know I've had to go through a lot of hassle and it's a bit annoying so anyway, on to our first game against Everton, um, FC, and a, you can just see a CD there, and a CD is a really good player, and I think it was, who was it who mentioned it to me? I think it was uh, Minecraft Impacts, but um, I can't remember. So we're in 12th place, and if we win today, if, well, if we win today, we'll go level on points with Everton in about 9th or 10th, so... Um, yeah, good lineup for us. I mean, we've got Fernandinho playing actually, but I'm gonna have like a road. It's road to inform Adebayo. Or he's gonna be out today as well, I think. And well, um, with FIFA 12, um, with this, I think I'll be doing it. Not only a manager my commentary, but like it's road to the best Bolton team. So the strikers' box is pretty much ticked now, but. Just mention any midfielders or defenders or goalies I should buy. So on to the first highlight when I see that he scores his first goal of the episode. When Abel Hernandez um, goes for the shot, it deflects off Tim Howard. And um, the CD go, I went for the cheap shot like and uh, Heitinger can't do anything. And so we show it again. Abel, it was quite unfortunate for Tim Howard as he nearly got the ball. But in 9 minutes in we are 1-0 in front against the... Uh, can't think what the name, but what's it? To the toffees, isn't it? Correct me if I'm wrong. But straight away, they hit back. Louis Saha in the 12th minute. I know he's at Tottenham now, but whatever. Um, because I haven't done the transfer updates, but I don't care. So they are one all. So CD into the box again, and he goes for the first. Now it's Mark Davies, and Mark Davies scored the goal for um, Bolton Wanderers. And in 41 minutes, we are 2 1 up against Everton FC. Nice clean goal. You would have thought a CD would have gone for the shot, but that doesn't matter because Mark Davis cleanly swept it in. So at half time, it was 2 1 to um, Bolton Wanderers. And what was this mistake? Bogdan. I mean, you can just see there, he comes out, he, chip, he gets the ball away. Lusa has it, he has a shot at Bogdan. Bogdan just leaves it to him and he just scores. So that's two all now, sadly. Um, pity actually, but who cares? So 88 minutes in now, I believe. Um, for Lyon, he gets taken down, but he doesn't really get taken down. I think that was a dive. I don't know. So Latin Baines from the free kick. Or could it go free to? And Bogdan makes an excellent save. And um, I think we'll have to be buying a new goalie soon because of. Um, yes, Galani. Oh, sorry. I've only just really got up. Last Galani um, will want to go soon, I'm assuming. And um, Bogdan's unsettled, apparently. So it's just last real chances for Baltimore Wanderers. Fernandinho plays it into. A CD and unfortunately it gets mis dispossessed. So um, at, at full time, the 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 game ends at two all at home. So, I mean that wasn't a bad result in all honesty. I'm quite glad. And obviously Jarvis plays for Everton now. So our next game is in the quarterfinals against Wolverhampton Wanderers in the League Cup. I will call it the Carling Cup, and. Um, I think it said to get it to a quarter final or a semi final of the one of the cups this year, and um, I'd love to win this match because the final would be a live commentary. Um, 
I don't know if it'll be with my mate or it'll just be me. I don't really know. So we're against Wolverhampton Wanderers who are not in form at all, really. To be honest. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, so we're uh, away to Wolverhampton Wanderers at what's supposedly Ivy, Ivy Lane, which is Molyneux, actually. And I've been to Molyneux before um, for my mate's birthday and it's really nice, but that's not Molyneux. <laughs> too small and um, there's a new stand anyway onto the match so this is a really big turning point for Baltimore Wanderers because if we can get to the semi-finals well even the finals of any domestic cup we could you know if we win that we you know we get I mean FA Cup you get more money in but you know you still win in the Carling Cup but Wolverhampton Wanderers have bought um Paulo Ferreira, I can't really see anyone else that bought actually to replace Jarvis. David Wheater has scored three goals in the FA uh, League Cup, so I'll be expecting him to perform a bit better. But we've changed our strike force, Klasnich and um, Kevin Davis, as you know, uh, they're not necessarily tied Apple and uh, Asuma, but I don't know if it's Asuma or As or Suma or whatever. Um, but I just, I guess I just wanted to uh, rotate the squad. So as you see, Klasny, Ivan Klasnic scores the first goal for Bolton, which puts us 1-0 in front and he skills the defenders, which was quite nice actually, um, and obviously puts us 1-0 ahead. So it's like half time pretty much now, but it's not yet. Because Kevin Doyle's up. Kevin Doyle's up. Kevin Cartley. No, it's not Kevin Cartley. It's Mike Cartley. Into Kevin. Into Stephen Fletcher. And he's made it 1 all. So at half time, it's going to easily be 1 all, really. Which I was a bit sad about because of. Um, I just really wanted to be in front at half time. And anyway, it was 1 all at half time, but. Wolves have a chance here to go for 2 1 in front, but Bogdan makes a brilliant save and um, Bolton scrabble it away. So, a CD? No. Kakuta? No. Oh, that was, a, that was poor, really. And then Fabio waxes it. Well, not wax, but whatever. That Mark Davis has got it now. A sumo CD? Abel Hernandez, what can he do from this? Can he finesse it into the goal? He can shoot and he can get it into the goal. We have just got into the semi finals and Les Wolves Hampton scores again. And yes, get in there because Abel Hernandez, what a strike from Abel. I mean, it's brilliant. So, 86 minutes in now. Um, Wolves are trying to find that goal that will get them into a um, extra time so they'll have a bit more chance but it was too little too late and we're in the semi-finals on the Carling Cup and I think we're against Everton or something I don't really know I can't remember so we did it actually escape by after um, we played the Wolverhampton and um, he looked quite good so I thought what the hell we may as well just sign him you know he's the one from Serbia so you know it doesn't matter really but um, January will bring the goalkeeper saga so it'll probably be better the goalkeeper saga Star Wars the goalkeeper saga <laughs> um, so our last match of the episode is against Tottenham Hotspur Spurs now really in the real game I think but I think um, it's going to be a tough match I think we could easily lose this one but let's just try and win and all the pressure's really been on Bogdan most of the season because he's a bit unsettled I don't know why because he's been playing every match he has to lie and I can understand if he wants to go because he hasn't played anything so we are in 12th in the tail still and we are looking for a win today to go level with Everton again. Um, so Tottenham have got a really good squad they have bought. Um, 
what's his name? Glenn Johnson from Liverpool. Um, my favourite club. Um, I think the chairman left there yesterday. I don't really care though. It's not the chairman, I think it's one of the directors, but whatever. Three minutes in, Asuma CD puts us 1-0 in front. Three minutes in, it's beautiful. Well done. I mean, Rick Ricardo Gardner have not given me much starts, but what an assist to uh, As As Osuma CD to score another goal. But straight away from that goal, Luka Modric um, gets it in the box. Skills for you, my players. And unfortunately, it makes it one all. So Pavlichenko has a chance here, but Bogdan easily saves it. Was it half time? No. Huddleston gets it in, and it was 2 1 to Tottenham. And unfortunately, really, we couldn't really do much more, but. In all honesty, one loss in a, I think one loss in an episode's not bad. One draw, one win, long loss. If we do lose this match, obviously. Um, but that was very poor defending one from the Bolton side. So Tottenham strengthen the lead. So we've got to get two more goals, unfortunately now. But we couldn't really do much. So at the end of the game, it was three one to Tottenham, and that was pretty much a top defeat from Tottenham and. They did bring Nanny on, so Tottenham got a lot of funds. So at the end of the episode, we are in 12th place in the table. So um, I thank you guys for watching. Recommend those players, and just thank you guys for watching. So I'll see you next time. Bye bye.